the way you hold your knife, the way we dance till three, the way you've changed my life. No, no, they can't take that away from me. No, they can't take that away from me. Ralph Bellamy has asked Fred, his friend and psychoanalyst, to help his relationship with his on-and-off-again fiancée, Ginger. The first attempt did not go well. This time, Bellamy invites Fred to the club to try again, and it goes much better. Under his guidance, Ginger eats a hard mix of dream-inducing food that leaves the other three guests queasy. It works, she dreams, to beautiful effect, but not with the intended result. What luck? None. Steve, can't you see the Dr. Flagg wants to ride with me alone? Will you please tell me something? Why were you suddenly so unfriendly yesterday? Quote, just another one of those dizzy, silly, maladjusted females who can't make up her mind, unquote. I'm afraid maybe you're right about my being maladjusted. We're never really afraid of anything we understand. Oh, it sounds as if it makes sense. Fear is just a simple phobia. Afraid of darkness, afraid of great heights, afraid of marriage. Yes, I guess so. I hate to be persistent, but I'm trying to help you and Steve. And I have to dream? Well, it would simplify matters. And it's possible to make a dream. Well, I'll try anything, if you can guarantee the dream. I imagine women find Dr. Flagg very charming. Especially girls. Why, Tony's a doctor, and Amanda's only his patient. He's all wrapped up in his work, isn't he? Miss Cooper is going to dream tonight by eating dream-provoking foods. And tomorrow I'll explain her dream to her. I'd eat anything if I thought it would make my dreams come true. <laughs> Bonsoir, mesdames, messieurs. May I recommend a filet mignon smothered with mushrooms? No, thank you. Uh, Miss Cooper will prefer a seafood cocktail. Seafood cocktail? With whipped cream. Pardon? Seafood cocktail with whipped cream? But not too much whipped cream, just a soupçon. Soupçon. Next, I'd like a large East Welsh rarebit. Ah, instead of the seafood cocktail with the whipped cream? No. You mean, madame, she wishes to eat them both? Yes. Double up on the cheese. Oh. Seafood cocktail with whipped cream. The largest Welsh rabbit. Lobster with gobs of mayonnaise. Cucumbers and buttermilk. I think I better go home and go to bed, Amanda. Oh, no. The fun's just beginning. Mine got near the end when you ate that second Welsh rabbit. Please, let's forget the experiment. Don't you feel sleepy, Miss Cooper? I never felt better in my life. In fact, right now, I'm sorry I had to pass up that second lobster. Oh, Amanda, please. Come on, Steve, there's nothing really wrong with you. It's all in your mind. Think you're all right, and you'll be all right. Oh, but those cucumbers and buttermilk and lobsters and strawberry shortcake, oh. See what I mean? suddenly change to a world as bright as the evening star. I used to be colorblind, but I met you, and now I find there's green in the grass, there's gold in the moon, there's blue in the sky. 
eyes. That semicircle that was always hanging about is not a storm cloud, it's a rainbow. You brought the colors out. Believe me, it's really true. Till I met you, I never knew a setting sun could paint such beautiful skies. Please like and subscribe.